guys welcome back to my channel so today is some project shares using the kiss craft easter dies i was able to play with some easter real quick i do still have my valentine's day stuff out let me jump into it i don't have um a lot of easter i have like this tiny container of easter stuff um two new things that i got this year from hobby lobby and then i have this jubilee from authentique this is not my style of crafting um i bought it because it was just so super cute um, years ago at Hobby Lobby, or not Hobby Lobby, um, Tuesday morning, and I just, I've never played with it, so I was like, you know what, I need to use my stash. Basket, jelly, bag. Okay, so this is it. It is so cute. So that paper pad actually has a uh, woven basket, like, material paper, so I used that, and then I backed it in some um, craft cardstock, because I did do each, this layer twice, this layer twice, and then the panel twice, and then I did go ahead and use a banner right here. This is the carrot one. It does come with layering pieces, which I don't know where they're at right now. <laughs> but um, I did puff it up on some foam, five millimeter foam. I did do the first layer in gold, kind of like Michelle, who is Paper Dreams and Things here. Um, they did have a cute little orange checker. So I just did the whole thing in checkered versus paper piecing little, little tiny carrots on. So I just left it like that. So cute. Um, the bow does come with the die. I did it in like the floral paper. And then I added some of this magical mix restore little like string. And then she had these bunnies. They're like an iridescent bunny. I did some pink ones as the centers. This little bow. These are from Hobby Lobby this year. So cute. I kind of just st stuck it in between the basket. The grass I did in a pattern paper of like green. And I think it is so cute. And this is going to hold so, so much. So another thing that I did, and I puffed them up on two layers of foam. Back piece is foam. And then I did pattern card stock. And then the top piece is foam as well. It's a sticker foam from Joann's. So it says Jelly Bean, Excellent, Blessed, Happy Easter, and Risen. So cute. I love these. And these, I'm going to um, package these up kind of like Lori, who's creating for fun. She packages them up like you would buy them from like a store and stuff. It's super cute with like a little bag topper. So those are going to go in there. Next is this one. Super simple um, for layering. Just layer, layer, and put it together. I didn't use the centerpiece. Um, there's a little bunny head, but I didn't use it. And again, I don't know where that bunny head is. Probably got thrown away. Oh, so cute. So I did paper from that paper pad. And these have cute little um, bunny cutouts. I don't know if you could really see. Uh, so this one had like a checkered, I did like a checkered. I curled the feet up a little bit. I backed it in gold. And it's like a a soft glitter paper that I have. It's a little bit more on the yellow side, but it's it's more pliable that I knew I could use for a bow without it creasing and cracking. And then I did a fun little iridescent pom-pom for like kind of mimicking a bunny tail as the center. So I did two of those guys. And then this one, I just did Magical Mix Restore. It's like this fun like furry like kind of like the cottontail again but this has like pink like different shades of pink ombre within it and then the actual bow on this one is foam glitter pink foam and it just pops out through the back so so cute and then i used the there's a easter add-on and the back scallop part is like little flowers for spring and easter you know it has other words and i gotta find those because <laughs> If you guys follow me on Instagram, you see that my die cutting station is a hot mess. So pieces are missing and hidden under trash. But to make this look even cuter, because that's the add-on, you have to get the KS Craft Summer Flag Set. And it comes with two pieces. And then you layer it up on your holiday ones. So, so there's Valentine's Day, Christmas, Easter. Super cute. And these are what I did. I used the Dollar Tree uh, Little Hearts. And I was going to try to use these, um, oops, where, the sticks, but the head was too big and the stick was too short. It just, it didn't look right. Hearts for Easter. It's still cute. Um, these little eggs were gifted to me. I'm pretty sure by Dina. Um, she gifted me er like erasers and like a little pack. So cute. I did a little tassel. Those are from AliExpress. And then this little fuzzy bunny is from Magical Mixery Store. I just punched a hole in its ear and then I did a little tiny eyelet and then the words are from the set. I did Faith and Spring and that sticker foam from Joann's and I did the, um, this is like a pattern paper from a different paper pad and the back I did pink. What else? Oh, and these little sequins right here are from like a little Easter mix from Magical Mixery Store and I kind of just like sporadically glued them on there. You can see them in person but probably not on video like where they're at and stuff. Super, super cute. At least super easy. I would get this even if you don't craft for Easter. 
just take away the bunny head and it is a super cute little bag so this is what it looks like assembled it's about six inches tall and four and a half inches wide and one and three fourths inches um, deep but so cute i just layered up the hand cut everything out twice one two this little glitter thing twice if you want the back to look cohesive and the side panels twice and that's it and then it folds over on the bottom and you have your cute little bag the little bunny i did in the michaels shimmer like pink paper the eyes eyebrow and nose i did go ahead and cut that out in a black foam and it just gave it a little bit more dimension this piece is also popped up with some pink foam tape and then the ears are actually a glitter felt that i have in my stash i'm trying to use like all the felts faux leathers all that because it is just i have drawers of it and it needs to be used <laughs> but yeah just a cute little bunny okay i think that is everything for the easter stuff so far and i was supposed to use these eggs remember i said i was going to cut them in half and use them as like flat back jammies i forgot to glue it i forgot i had these and it was already too late to put them on the bows so i need to put these on my desk so my next round of easter stuff i remember to use those things all right bye guys i'll link stuff down below